In this demonstration, we're just going to create this simple hydronic system. I'm going to come up to the toolbar and hover over this icon. It says boiler, and I'm going to left click on it. And now I have the boiler on my cursor. Another left click drops it on the screen. I'm going to come up now to this red icon. It says impose load, hit the little arrow down, terminal unit coil, and drop that down on the drawing as well. Now I need to connect these two together. Next to the selector up here at the top is the connector. I'm going to click on that connector. You see it's a little squiggly line. As soon as I make a connection to that boiler, it turns it green, signifying I made a connection. Whenever I left click, I can put an elbow in the pipe, connect to the coil, left click, left click, left click, back to the boiler. Now the pipes are black. That tells me no information is being transferred. Every component is intelligent and smart. So I can double left click on the component and come in here and type in the load. 600,000 BTUs and hit OK and you'll see that that load information has been transferred down. And I can click on this pipe and kind of string it up a little bit if I want to as well. To make the drawing the same we need to come up to the pump and drop it on. And as long as we drop it on one pipe it'll snap it in just nicely. There's the pump snapped in. There's a air separator in the project. And let's just come up here and do a little copy and paste that down. And you can see how it made this expansion tank number two automatically for me, as well as the other components. Put that in the system. Okay, now to make it similar to the drawing above, I need to look at the pipe sizes. So I'm going to drag a box across, right click with my mouse, and here I have the ability to come in, hydronic pipe annotation, and annotate the drawing with any of those items. I'm going to choose diameter, and there's the diameter of this uh, system as well. Obviously, if you click on that system, that load, let me do that right here, and come in and make it 6 million BTUs, pipe sizes are going to increase dramatically, boiler sizes flow, and everything. This is how easy it is to design a hydronic system in HVAC Solution. Download it today from our website, hvacsolution.com, and get started. Thank you.